Hello, this is Tate with Black Bear Outdoors, um, blackbearoutdoors.net. You know, we wanted to finish up our talk on compost tea. And I had two questions before we kind of get started today on, on our other video. Was one, why do we com do compost tea? We do compost tea because of two reasons. One, it helps stretch our compost, so it actually lasts a lot longer. Like I said, five gallons with only a cup of dirt lasts us about a whole acre. And we get a huge benefit of it because we're brewing the microorganisms that are in the dirt already. So we're taking that microorganism count and timesing it by 50, roughly. You know, I mean, I'm not exactly on that, but what we're doing is allowing it to brew up those microorganisms over time and getting all ready to go. Which is why, you know, how often should I use it? It should be used, we use it here about twice a week. Once a month, to twice a week is kind of the standard. Um, the other thing is, is that, you know, when I'm spraying it, how am I, should I spray it? And we're going to talk about that here in just a second. So here, I want to show you our, our tea that's been brewing for the last two days here. And you'll see all these great bubbles. Now the bubbles actually, you, if you can see here, the dirt level here, that's where all the dirt has actually been getting up to, and it's spraying all of our pumps here and things like that. But it's been getting bubbling, and that's what you want to see. That's what the molasses does to it. Now, once we see that, we are going to, and try to hang on with me here, we're going to show you what we do with it. Now, we've got a lot of our plants here that have been doing really, really good. And what we're going to be doing is spraying it on the leaves. We've got our pump sprayer here that I've pumped up. We've got a nice mist going and what I want to do is get it underneath the leaves and on top of the leaves. You know, Like I said, this small amount of tea will last us exponentially spraying it on the leaves. And I use this mix for my tomatoes and everything else. You know, and we I use this twice a week, so I brew, I brew two batches of tea a week. And I want to use the tea within about a four-hour period of brewing it. So if you're buying it, making sure you're buying it from somebody who's brewing it locally and that they're able to get it to you fairly quickly. The microorganisms after about four hours, you know, stop working as well. So when I brew mine, I'm trying to make sure I brew it to a point of where I'm getting it very, very close to the time I'm going to be using it. Like as I'm using this, I'm keeping the rest of it brewing while I'm using my stuff here. All right, well, if you guys have any questions, feel free to hit us up at blackbarrowdoors.net and um, check out our website.